And what we have here is an awesome one for one trading system that works on every single version. Very simple, throw the thing in and you'll get whatever it gives you right there. Hey there guys, Skippy here for Rub Skippy 6 Gaming. Guys, coming to you from what is the new tutorial land mixed with uh, fun adventures. And we are going to do this super easy one for one trading system. Just throw something in there and uh, it gives it to you. You can set up what you want and what you get. It is going to be one for one. I'm going to give a shout out to Seth Bling. This is like an old school Seth Bling tutorial uh, from like when Hoppers first came out ever. Uh, it, I adapted a little bit on the end here to make it work perfectly for Bedrock as well, so shoutouts to him. He has a 4 for 1 one that I'm still playing with on the end to try to fix it, but I think we'll be able to do it. Link to his channel in the description. So, uh, yeah, let's do this, guys. It's a very simple build, very easy. You could tile it, again, just keep them one apart because these will power each other, and uh, powering each other is not good. For this build here, guys, let's go for 261 likes. If you are one of those dudes, don't forget to hit me up in the comments. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to tell you what you need, guys, for this build you're gonna need at least one item frame if you want it to look pretty like mine one uh, trap door uh, five redstone dust two redstone torches one comparator that is a dropper but you need a dispenser do not bring a dropper uh, three hoppers one chest eight blocks of choice and at least 22 of the payment block that you're gonna take so let's do it I just take a two hole deep in the ground like you know as big as big as you need man is you don't need this much room but I'm not messing with it today so let's say that we're gonna put uh, this guy right here we're gonna want this guy here let's put our chest one back just like that now we're gonna grab our hoppers make sure you shift click or crouch place or whatever it is into the chest into the hopper there, go ahead and grab your dispenser and stay crouched and put it facing forward right on this guy. Now you're just gonna shimmy around, again, stay crouched and put that hopper in there. Okay, so that's most of the front, uh, the front finagling. Let's go ahead and do a little redstoning. So block right here, redstone comparator right here. That comparator is going to go up into a block. This block is going to come forward like this. This block is going to have a redstone torch on it. We want to take this signal and bring it around. We're going to do that very simply by adding a block right here and then a block up just like that. Looks good, feels good. Grab some redstone dusts and put one here, one here, one here. Once we've done this, now we just want to bring our torch up to the front like that. Once, as you can see, basically we're one away and we just want to bring two blocks up to the front here. So let's go do that right now. We're going to go put block right there block right there this one here this is where i had to change it basically i've moved it in the ground and on bedrock you don't necessarily need to do it in this sense if you had a block right here it would power this so but on Bedrock, either way it works on all versions if you actually put both dust just like that so now we want to make it take iron so let's go ahead and set up the payment system we're going to go in here and we're going to put 22 of course so one two three four five one two three four five one two three four five five one two three four five and one two so now it will know that uh, once we put in an iron, which is the one, we are going to get whatever it is. So let's just give it uh, gold. One iron for one gold just to show you how easy it is. Throw this, whatever you're going to pay out in this hopper right here. And uh, yeah, we should be good if, uh, look at that, I have to actually go get iron. Once we do this, we're going to go like this. And it gives you what you need. So now what you have to be careful with is uh, go ahead and grab that uh, trap door because that's why we're using the trap door here actually just crouch place and just put it right on top of there so basically now when you throw your iron in it will clap clap and give you what you need let's go ahead and uh, check it out and then that's the other reason why we need to have uh those stairs or else this would be a perfectly flush door but done beautiful 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 build up around it do what you need to do uh yeah do this whatever's and on here is where the stair is. So basically, uh, I just put a stair there. You know, you don't have to. I'll, I'll go grab a stair. Since everybody's trying to make it look pretty, um, let's just grab this guy right here. So, yeah. Basically, a stair is the way. This is honestly pretty cool because in the other way, if you don't need this block, if you don't need this dust here in the way that he did it, it would be above the ground, but it would sit flush. So right here, I'll just do this. And then again, you could just continue your wall actually right there. Look at that done done and done you have your whole entire center you're trading iron for gold you're gonna get rich and yeah as easy as that guys don't forget to smash that like before you go don't forget as well uh to subscribe clapper 
I want to call it the clapper. We should call it the clapper. Don't forget to smash that like before you go. Don't forget as well to subscribe to my channel. And uh, yeah, catch you guys on the next one.